Hey everyone, this is Micah from Cali Raised LED. Today I'm gonna to show you how to install our Forerunner Molly exterior window panel. In your kit, you're gonna get your window panel. You're gonna get the mount that attaches to the roof rack, two gussets, two suction cups, nine 5 16th inch bolts, and four M6 hex nuts. Tools that you're gonna need, it's gonna be a 3 16th inch Allen head, 5 32nd Allen head, a 10 millimeter socket, and a 10 millimeter wrench. Let's go ahead and get started. So first thing that we're gonna to wanna to do to get this installed is we're gonna to wanna to get our suction cups attached. Uh, you have four of these M6 nuts. Uh, that makes it adjustable so that you can adjust the height of them. I'm gonna go ahead and go pretty much most of the way down on these just to begin with. And then if we want to adjust it a little bit higher later on, then we can. We got that first nut on. Uh, there's a set of holes along this bottom row. I like to go one hole in from each side. That's usually works pretty good. Pull that on there. My next nut on, get it finger tight for the moment. All right, we'll get our next one installed. There. that one tight. All right, this is where we can use our wrench and our socket. We go with the wrench on the back side, socket on the front. Get these tightened up. One. All right, there we go. Suction cups installed. Let's go to the vehicle. All right, next step on the install is to remove the roof rack bolts. We're gonna take out these six. Uh, these attach the rails on your roof rack. They will drop a little bit, it's okay. We'll just lift them back up when we, uh, when we install them out. So I'm gonna go ahead and take these off. As you can see, the roof rack side kind of pulled away. That's okay. We will get it attached when we get our mount up there. All right, so next part, we've got these two holes and these six holes. They're gonna match up with those. I like getting these ones first. We're gonna take our five 16 inch bolts. Go ahead and match it up. I'm all, there it goes. Got that one started. Second one in. All right, that's good. Now we can take our 3 16 inch Allen head, fishing, tightening up these 5 16 inch bolts. All right, we've got our nice and light panel. Uh, you can see there's two holes here that have threads on them already, and then there's one up here. We're gonna attach those first, and then we'll use our gussets and attach the side ones. So just lay this up here, get it more or less in place. Start getting these screwed in. Speed. All right, so we've got two different gussets, so that's you can tell. There's one long, one short. The long one goes towards the front, shorter on the back. You can see the holes are quite a bit different. These holes go up towards the top, these ones on the side. We're gonna do this one first. This flange will go towards the inside as well. Slide that underneath. All right, then we just take our 3 16th inch Allen, finish tightening them up. All right. Now the suction cups, you can kind of just push down on them. Uh, it's good to kind of experiment a little bit by pushing. This is why we have them adjustable so you can get it off a little bit farther. You just want to make sure if stuff is weighing on your panel, it's not going to touch your paint and scrape it up. 
Uh, so if you need to adjust that, you know, pretty easy to take it off. Just change those up, push them down a little bit, and reattach it. All right, that concludes our installation of the Forerunner exterior window molly panel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And please visit www.caliraceled.com and order yours today.